Yes, hi everyone, my name is Lupita and welcome to the Cookie Couture where flavor and design collide. Today I'm going to share with you how you can decorate a sugar plum fairy decorated cookie in two different ways and I hope that you like it. Okay, so let's get started. Very well, we have our ballerina in the stick and I already put here the flesh color icing in the arms, the face, the neck and her legs and now I am going to make the little tutu. So first I am going to start by adding the ruffles here in the bottom. Then you can use white or pink icing, any color that you want to outline the tutu in this case I am going to use a bright pink color and then I am going to flood all the tutu with a little bit of fuchsia icing And if you want to have an effect of tulle fabric on cookies, using sand and sugar is a great tip. And also I'm going to add a little bit of ruffles in here. And then we're going to wait a little bit more so the ruffles are dry so we can make some drawings and also we're going to add a little bit of detail on the ballet slippers. Ballerina cookie, we are going to use outlining consistency in white, firm consistency in fuchsia, the sprinkles, 
I prepared this sprinkle specially for this cookie and a little bit of flooding consistency in maroon color. With my medium consistency white icing, I am going to outline all the tutu of the ballerina. Very well, now I outline the tutu of the ballerina and I am going to use my floating consistency icing in maroon and I'm going to put it in all the tutu. And later on we are going to prepare all the decorations of the tutu. And for this cookie all the tutu is going to fill up with sprinkles and tannin sugar. This is why I am starting with the tutu. And also I am going to add a little bit of sprinkles in the little crown. I am going to put a little bit of gold pearls in the crown and also in the tutu. We're going to let them dry a little bit and later on we are going to make the legs, the arms and the face. Before my cookie is completely dry, I'm going to add these big purple pearls in the bottom of the tutu. Then I will flood the legs, the arm and the face of the ballerina. Before your cookie is completely dry, you're going to start making the decorations using the firm consistency icing in fuchsia. You are going to make some ruffles on the arms, the little top and on the bottom of the tutu. For this I use a decorating tip number 101 S from Wilt. Then you will need to thin it out a little bit of this color of icing to make the little palette slippers. Then when your cookie is completely dry, you are going to use edible markers in black, pink and red to make the eyes, the cheeks and the little mouth. Okay guys, thank you so much. I really hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. This is a very, very cute cookie and I hope that it's going to be a very cute addition to your nutcracker parties or your Christmas gifts. Everybody will love to receive a sugar plum fairy cookie, especially made by you, okay? If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe and also if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave me a comment or a question if you have any and I will be very happy to take a look at them and also um, if you want to know how to decorate a nutcracker I will leave you a link in the description box so you can see how to decorate a nutcracker and also I'm going to leave you a link here so you can follow me on my social media and I think so that's it for today guys thank you so much and see you next time bye bye